Cody broke Sasha out of Fern Cliff, y'all. They ain't got no type of security. They don't never have no type of security. He don't got the main time. Doc up. I said, this what Doc get. He's sitting up there screaming and stuff. I wonder if the needle thing was in his pocket and if Cody going to find it or not. But hey, y'all, welcome back to another review of Life with Chester. This was Jenna Hospital, September 8, 2023. Cody did exactly what he said he was going to do. That's a look. Now, they ain't got no type of security. How he able to get into this doggone institution, break in. Well, he ain't break in, but pretend to be one of the patients. Get in. Get in Sasha's room. Break out of his room. Get in her room. Break her out. Tie this dude up. He deserved to be tied up. Look, I thought that when they got the fighting, they was gonna, one of them was going to get injected by that needle. I don't even know if Doc had it, but he had to because he snuck in. He had came back in. He had already been there. So, when the nurse lady left, he came. He went into Sasha's room. Room, but he wasn't expected to see Cody so Cody didn't know he didn't remember you remember when they was at the pool before uh Sasha stabbed Cody and she uh and um he was looking at them I think it was that the same scene or a different scene I think there was a different time they was at the pool and Cody seen Gladys and Doc together and he was watching them I said he didn't think about that I've been saying it but yeah he finally put two and two together and Doc tried to say oh he's crazy they, he gonna tell them to up his meds look I knew I was like they he better be careful because uh, they might try to inject him they already gave him pills but he didn't take it though so that he gonna try to tell Sasha to come with him Doc did so they got the tussle in and I was like, ooh, somebody gonna get injected. I didn't even know if they had it or not. But they still didn't show if they had the needle. But uh then they show Cody with Sasha trying to leave out and the nurse lady uh, was basically saying, Where you going? He gonna say to get take her for a walk. Then the other lady, what's her name? Oh, I forgot her name. What's her name? Ooh, I wrote it down. It's somewhere in my notes, y'all. That lady, um, I can't think of her name, the one with the blonde hair. The one that was helping, he, she, I don't think she actually knew what was going on because she's, even when Sasha told her to keep Dr. Monique, Doc, away from her, she didn't listen. She went, reported back to Doc. But yeah, he on the floor. I said, look, they gonna need to question, that's why everybody should have came together and stuff because now Cody might be in trouble. And Mac, hopefully Mac on his way there because, you know, he was talking to Felicia, but Felicia had talked him out of coming, but that don't mean he still ain't gonna come. And now that they don't alerted the security, he gonna come, Dante gonna come. I said, look, this gonna be a situation. I said, I wonder where he gonna take her. I think on this episode too, Nina was calling to say if, if um, they don't have Sasha, she going up there to find out what's going on. I said, yo, it's time for Doc to go to jail. It's time for Gladys to go to jail. Look, take away Doc's license. I don't know. And, and when he was talking to Sasha, he was talking about somehow when he he when he have a patient, he with them to the end. They got to investigate how many people he done did this to and why. What's wrong with him? <laughs> what's wrong with him? But yeah, look, Cody did exactly what he said he was going to do, y'all. He broke her out. He broke her out. I said, look, he done knocked him out. Ned, we got to talk about Ned next because, well, we got to talk about Eddie Main. Because do y'all think he's starting to remember? I thought he was going to fall or something to get his memory back. Look, because uh, I don't know. He was like zoning out and stuff. And even with his song, like, who is he talking about in his song? Like, I feel like his memory about to get ready to come back. I don't know, though. I don't know. But if he act like something wrong, I don't know. If it's slowly starting to come back, it probably won't be a while till it fully come back. But Sonny, uh, look, hearing stuff supposed to be next week, y'all, on Monday's episode. Um, also, I said, Olivia look like she fascinated by Eddie Man. <laughs> like, she fascinated to me. But uh, Nina, Nina was talking to Anna, trying to see if she found out anything, she know anything about what's going on. Anna didn't know. Anna decided to go see Curtis, and he was like, he, at first he hated her and Sunday for what happened to him, but then he got over it or whatever. And Portia gonna tell her, don't come back. <laughs> she gonna tell Anna, don't come back here. And uh, Curtis was like, he, he can't blame Anna for what happened. She was like, she can. She was like, she can. Um, Spencer and Trina, they supposed to be on Monday's episode, y'all. They didn't show it on the day, but... I was going to mention that because people have been speculating that they finally finna get ready to share a scene. Dex and Josh. Look, Josh ain't going to feel some type of way. All this. Look, told y'all. She was more, I've been studying saying how she been more upset about, you know, the Sunny situation than Carly. But now, you more upset than your boyfriend. Your boyfriend just said that if Sunny goes to jail, uh, a hole will be in his life. Look, I said, mm, mm, mm. That's so sad. Look, he's like, he view him, he kind of view him as a father figure. I said, I don't know. People been putting out those little videos where they said that they believe that Dex is either Sonny's son or someone from his past or Jason or somebody connected to Sonny, basically. And I said, I, they usually make people connected to him somehow. They'll have the people on the show for a split. I ain't going to say a split second. They'll have them on the show for a while. Then they said, no, they related to one of the quarter mans. They related to somebody on the show. <laughs> they their long lost son. They the son of one of their ex-girlfriends 
little something. I said it won't be long now. I said I can see that happening though. But yeah, um, I like Dex. I I find it interesting. I don't like that, you know, the whole situation with him spying on Sunny because I want to know how Sunny gonna react to that. But yeah, like how y'all think this Sunny thing gonna turn out? Because like I said, they still gotta do the whole exposing Nina thing, so you gotta get out. I mean, if one is Sunny, he always get out. But two, that whole storyline, let's say abandoning it. Ava was trying to talk some sense into Nina and let her know, you know, this is who Sonny is. You got to get used to it, but she still don't get it. How you still not going to get it? I think, look, his ex-wife done told you. All the mother of his children, not all the mother of his children, but basically Alexis done told her, Olivia done told her, Carly done told her, Ava done told her. I said, that is all the, all his baby mamas, ain't it? That's all. Wait a minute now. Sam, I mean, they baby didn't make it, but still. Look, everybody done told her what it is, and she still, like she in La La Land or something. <laughs> She must still be in Nixon Falls or something. Even when he was in Nixon Falls, he still was showing signs of Sunny, though. So, well, yeah, Ava was trying to tell her, and then Ava brought up, you know, her secret and stuff. I said, yeah, it's about time for that to come out anyways. It's about time anyways. Uh, Sonny else I forgot to mention. Josh was telling the days that basically he can't blame himself for the choice of Sonny made. I said, right, because when he get out, he's still going to be doing the same thing. And that's why I said, ain't it time for him to retire? <laughs> I said, ain't time for him to retire. It's about that time now. You can only get away with stuff for so long. But then again, it's the Sonny Carly show. So <laughs> it's a, it hasn't been the Sonny Carly show in a while. But I still feel like regardless, it's going to always be the Sonny Carly show where they get away with everything and people be turning a blind eye. I said, you got to see. Look, but I hate this for Nina because Willow going to be mad at her. Uh, Sonny going to be done with her. And yeah, they know what they're doing. But that's it, y'all. Let me know down below how y'all feel about all this. Like, look, General Hospital, I'm telling y'all, it's getting interesting. I want, do y'all think Ned's memory coming back? His memory needs to come back. Esme's memory needs to come back. Who else's memory gone? They done did so many people. I know it's Ned. I know Esme. I feel like it was another person. Was it another person whose memory got lost? I don't know. But that's it, y'all. Let me know down below what y'all thought of this episode. Stay tuned for more videos. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. Until next time, deuces. Have a great weekend. Be safe. Deuces. I already said deuces. <laughs> All right. Oh, God.